Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Tobin MUA. If you are new, welcome to my channel. Today is going to be this fun half cut crease like neutral eye moment. I absolutely love how this look turned out. Oh my god. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with the lip. I'm obsessed with just everything. I use two new palettes. I used some Pixie by Petra palettes. Both of these are on my eyes today, so if you guys do want to see how to recreate this look, then just keep on watching. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial, and I have my brows already done as well as my eyes prepped for the shadow. So let's get right on into this tutorial. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going in with my Morphe 35O palette and I'm going to be going in with this brown shade right here. It is a more warmer brown shade and I'm going to go in to that with a MAC 224 brush and I'm just going to be placing that in my crease. So next I'm going to be going in with my new palettes. These are the Pixie palettes by Petra and I'm going to be using these today. I'm so excited about these. I got these as a surprise in my P.O. box and so I was super pumped about that. So I'm going to, I think I'm going to go in. This is, I got the Reflex Light Palette and the natural beauty palette. I'm going to go into the reflex light palette today and I'm going to be first I'm going to be doing a little carve and carving out where is my favorite carving brush. So today's video I'm going to be doing a half cut crease and I'm going to be carving out my cut crease with the Makeup Revolution C6 concealer. I'm going to place that on the back of my hand and I'm going to be going in with the Wet n Wild. This doesn't have a name, but it is a flat brush. And I'm just going to coat that. So I'm going to be going in with the Pixie Reflex Palette and this is what it looks like. So, so pretty. And I think I'm going to, I might do this shade. I might mix this, actually they have the names. So, Chestnut and Gold Foil. I might mix those two together. I'm gonna go cut the other eye off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so now that I have the other eye down, I'm going to be going in with, this is chocolate brown, and I'm going to blend that on the outer corners. I'm gonna use my Morphe E506 brush. Looking good, looking good. I'm going to highlight the brow bone with the shade Vanilla Glaze or Glitz. Vanilla Glitz right here. I'm going to spray my brush with a little bit of Gerard Cosmetics Slay All Day Setting Spray in Peach. Okay. 
Shade is so pretty. I'm gonna blend at that. This could be a highlight. Multi-purpose pixie. And it's like a white gold shade. So, so pretty. I love those shades. I went back in with a little bit of the 35O palette. Back in with that brown shade just to help blend a little bit more. So, so pretty. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Mm. It looks so good. I'm loving it. Okay, so now I'm going to go in to my face products and the foundation I use is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in Amber Beige. I'm going to be using the Lexi Small Contouring Brush for this. So I'm going to go on to concealer. I'm going to be using the C6 concealer. Not too much because this is a light shade. But we do like a bright under eye. So I'm going to be taking my Morphe Beauty Blender and just blending that out. I'm going to be using the Gerard Cosmetics Honeymoon Palette. This is my favorite contour or bronzer as you will. I'm going to bronze up my skin now. I'm using the Luxie Angled Brush for this. I'm gonna go in with the wiped up blush, which is this blush right here. I'm gonna finish up my under eye first and then we'll go on to highlighter. So for the lower lash line, I'm gonna go back in with so for the lower lash line, I'm going to go back in with the Morphe 35O palette. I'm going to go in with that brown shade and a little bit. I'm going to go in with this shade right here and this shade right here. So I'm going to go in with these two shades and dust that on my lower lash line.
So I'm going to be going in with a new Morphe brush today. I picked uh, this up. This is the M408 brush. And I picked this up a couple of weeks ago at the Morphe store. And I'm so excited to use it. I'm going to be going back in with that chocolate brown shade. And I'm going to be smudging that right up against my lower lash line. Go and go back in with it, my M506 brush and just buff that. So apologize for lighting change. I'm pretty sure the lighting has changed a little bit. It has gotten darker now. Um, but I finally have my camera pre-charged now my camera died that's why I had to step away for a few minutes but you guys didn't know that you're just knowing that now because I'm telling you but um, yeah so I have blush which I have a lot of blush on so I need to put some highlight on to help with that um, I want to do first I want to do eyeliner I'm gonna do a black liner nope that is not it Okay, here it is. I'm going to be using the Eyeliner Zero from Urban Decay and lining my waterline. Okay, so I just tight lined and put that on my waterline. I'm going to do lashes and mascara and I will be right back so lashes are on and the lashes I am wearing are the D301 lashes from Dodo lashes I do have a coupon code if you guys do want to try them out they are only range from like five dollars to like twelve dollars so definitely check them out I'll have a link below for you guys and as well as the coupon code so definitely give them a look I'm absolutely obsessed with how these lashes look with this I look so yeah they're so nice they're fluffy and they're awesome I love these ones so for lipstick I'm going to be going in with my favorite lip liners I'm going to be going in with sugar and spice and mudslide so I think I might do maybe possibly just sugar and spice all over the lips with a gloss on top so I'm going to try that. If not, I'm going to go in with mudslide on top and then uh, sugar and spice in the inner part of the lips. I love, I love, I love, I love. I'm going to go in with a little bit of mudslide. Now I'm going to go in, I think I'm going to go in with a little bit of buttercream from Gerard Cosmetics as well, which is a lip gloss. I'm loving it. I'm going to go also in with a little bit of Shimmer of Hope. It's another gloss from Gerard. Just like combining products, I now want I want to go in with another gloss. I'm just adding glosses. I'm gonna go in with Coca Bean. Love it. So now on to one of my favorite favorite parts, and pretty much the end of this video, which is highlighter. And I'm going to be going in with my Amrezy Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighter such a beautiful oh so so pretty 
I'm gonna spray my face with my mini little Slay All Day setting spray. I'm also going to spray the highlighter. We're going to go in and highlight. I'm using my Morphe M501 brush. And you are finished. So this is the final look. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this half cut crease tutorial. If you did, definitely give this video a thumbs up and comment below what you guys want to see next on my channel. Give this video a thumbs up and follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both those are at TobinMUA. I would love it if you shared this video with your friends. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.